a bar chart is used when you make a comparison between countries, between product or between department. So meaning to say, if you have a comparison between countries, products or even department, you can actually use bar chart whereby you can show the descending order from the largest to the smallest. But if just say you want to make a comparison by year, so how to do it? Okay, so I'm just going to copy this and I want to put it over here. Okay, so I'm just going to put this as total population. Okay, maybe I'll just put here a prostophene, prostophy, and uh, I just put here equal prostophy. Okay, so total population in. So the next thing is I'm going to copy this and I'm going to paste it over here. I go to pivot table analyze. I click the fill list so that the fill list appear. So this time I remove the continent. I put the financial year at the row. Country name I put at the filter. Okay, so now it looks better. I click the pivot chart. I choose column. So I click like this. And then I go to pivot chart again. So this time I insert slicer. I choose the country name. So country. So there you go. So we have the country name. We do have the chart. So I click this. Shift. Control X. And I go over here. So I press Control V. Okay. So now I'm going to uh, I'm just going to click this. Just press it over here. I'm going to close this, close this, and close this. So I just right click, I hide all fill, I delete this, I press start element, I remove grid line, I remove legend, and I put data label. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to upkeep this. I'm going to put it at the as big as this. So the next step is I go here. I'm going to copy this. Paste as value. Okay, equal. If all is equals to all, then it should be the world. Otherwise, it should be known as this particular country. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I put this and and over here. Okay, so if you just say I click Algeria, so we can see the total population in Algeria and I can remove the title. So now we can see the trend for the next four years. Okay, so if I click Australia, you can see the total population in Australia from 2018 up to 2019. So meaning to say, if just say you have a bar chart. A bar chart is whereby we do a comparison between the countries, product and department. But column chart, as I show over here, in this column chart, we show comparison among along the years. So if you want to make a comparison along the years, we use column chart.